Okay. Hi, everybody. <laughs> I'm th okay, th I'm kind of laughing because I just went through like seven or eight mic tests, and this was the best idea was to like, actually get my headset. I know, I know I look kind of ridiculous with the hat and the, the headset on. Well, that's because the reason why I have the hat on is because last time you guys saw me, I had moderately long hair. Now, my hair is actually long. And I have to wear the hat to keep the bangs out of my face. So now... I have to wear a hat around the house so I can at least decently see it, or the bangs will like cling onto my eyebrows and it gets nuts. Anyway, back to the reason why you probably tuned in here is for Revenge of the Fallen, Chromia. Now I managed to find her at a Walmart, actually my Walmart, right around my block. Cool. Um, was just walking through thinking, oh god, they're only gonna have Wave One. No, they only have you know. Uh, Rampage, they only have Sideswipe, they only have Demolisher, um, no Soundwave, only Bumblebee. I walked through there and I was actually kind of shocked that I actually had Chromia and Wheelie. So I just thought, oh, okay, I'll drop the 20 bucks and I got them both. But to my shock, when I was going to, through the electronics department, I forgot that this came out. I was so happy. I was so happy when that came out. Um, I actually it's stuck in my DVD player right now. Um, been watching it, reliving my four-year-old, five-year-old days. It's been so great. Anyway, to get back onto the review, I'm actually probably gonna end up doing an update review followed by a bloopers and like a shitload of other videos. Anyway, this is Chromia, said to be one of the three RC twins. Twins, not triplets, in the new movie. Uh oh, as you can see, she comes with a stand that clips on right here. Well, if you take it off, it clips onto the this little hinge right here. But you can hook it on right there and use it, use it as a decent stand. See, or. Have a hook onto the back like that, and have the kickstand down. See the kickstand? Okay, just to get it shot out of the way, get out of the way. So I don't probably won't have any compliments. Little the little try thing that help, that's supposed to make me combine is right there. There's the groove. You can see it from better shade forward. And where can is that? There it is. There's the little notch. That little notch will fit into that groove on the other ones. Now to get this get get her started, well if you have this attached like I have it to make it look cooler, more kick ass guns on the back guns on the back. All you have to do is just pop that off and set that to the side. Then um forgot there for a second what to do. Oh yeah. Just flip those up like so. Then you go put your finger right here, hook that, and pull. It's our arm. Then you go lift this up, her seat, like that. Then you actually hold onto this and pull. Oh, come on. Like so. That becomes her arm. And you push the little license plate thing up back like that. Now you have to pull this like that. The little thing on the inside becomes detached. You can just pull. Okay, nothing broke. Good. Extend it like that. Do the other, same thing on the other arm. the head up and just snap them together like so. Then all you do is just push this down, push that up. Oh no, push this up, then that up. And then you just take this little flap. It's, it's spring loaded so it just comes right back down like that. Boop. Extend like that. 
the flap on the other arm. Just ugh. Oh, you pull back. Ugh. Like that. And there you got chromia. Oh yeah, and then you gotta turn that around. Like so. Like looks like she's got a little see? Right in the crotch area too. Just a little Keep centering it down here. <laughs> and anyway, you just take the stand, in case you want to split her like this. There's that little hinge again. Ah, damn. Ta -da. See? And you can split her like that. Now, of course, she does come with the spring loaded missile. It's very, it's clear actually. Which I don't see why. So I just keep it in there. Now, that was the figure. And for some very, very, very strange odd reason, a lot of people don't like Chromia RC and the third unnamed purple uh, purple triplets. They don't like them because they're funky. They're... they're uh, they have a wheel for a foot, or wheels for a foot. It, you know, they're not, they don't meet the stand. They don't meet the standard um, two arm, two regular arms, two legs, and that's it. But I have to kind of give credit for the uh, character designers or whoever designed the robots for the second movie to actually go out there and go beyond just, well, they're robots. They have to be human-like. No, they're from a different planet they can look completely different like i like the approach on the insecticons the insecticons are actually fucking insects like it shows in the clip sam actually holds an insect in his hands it's literally that big mm. and um now i've yet to see the movie as of today today right now is the 22nd no it's the 21st it's the 21st because um, tomorrow will be the 22nd, and I have to buy my ticket for Transformers tomorrow, and then I'm going to see it on the midnight show on Tuesday. Yeah, I'm here in the United States. I've already seen the reviews, I already kind of spoiled myself. Whoopee, I spoiled myself on the first one. I already knew Megatron was going to die, I just didn't know how. Um, so far everybody said, um, now we'll put a warning on here, uh, I have to put a warning on here for spoilers. <laughs> it will contain some spoilers, but apparently Prime will die in the second movie. Now this is this this is I'm recording this on a Sunday. Um, I've already seen Dinus's Dinus's or Silverbolt's review. I've already seen Callow Prime's review over it in his little board. And it sounds like a fairly decent movie. But anyway, Chromia. I'm very fascinated by these motorcycle chicks. Don't know why. As soon as I see all them, I'm like, I want them. I want them all. Maybe, I think mostly because they're all combiners. I'm a sucker for combiners. Which is why I'm trying to get all the Constructicons. But they don't combine. <laughs> yeah, they don't combine, which made me sad. But I'm still going to get them anyways, and I'm going to get the Supreme Devastator and have them all displayed with Devastator in the background and all my construct cons up front. In robot form, of course. Um, anyway. Chromia here. Really decent. Because I'm, uh, I don't, I don't, I think everybody's really complaining about her designs, but, um, about their designs, but I see they have all their designs for a purpose, like they're all kind of lopsided or something. I think the lopsidedness will contribute to the combined form. Like this big arm gun, and this giant empty space right here. I think all this, this giant empty space, and the big arm gun for her will contribute to the body of RC. The big RC, not the pink little deluxe, the actual RC. Ugh. My time's up. I know this is kind of me like kind of rambling. Well, for me, it's 2:15 in the morning here, and I'm just now got a chance to record something. My sister and my sister is in bed now. Fun, and I'm fixing to do another review on another figure. See you guys then.